Stop frustrating your readers with long, hard to navigate documents. In this tutorial, I'll show you how to insert a table of contents in Microsoft Word in just three minutes. So anyone can jump to any section instantly. If you find it helpful, don't forget to hit the like button. Let's get started. First, make sure your document has proper headings. Highlight your section titles, then go to the Home tab. And under the Styles group, choose Heading 1, Heading 2, or Heading 3, depending on the level of your headings. This step is crucial. Without headings, Word will not know what to include in your table of contents. Now, let's use this document. Introduction is a main heading, so we make it heading 1. Chapter 1 is also a major heading. Make it heading 1. Now, what you need is a subheading under chapter 1, so we make it heading 2. Setting up your document is a subheading under chapter 1. Now, chapter 2 is also a main, a main heading. To make it Heading 1. Using headings, make it Heading 2. Why headings matter is a subheading under Chapter 2, so you make it Heading 2. Let's proceed to Chapter 3. That is a main heading, so make it Heading 1. Conclusion is a main heading, so make it Heading 1. And that is it. You have formatted your document using heading styles. Now Microsoft Word can, can understand what to place where in your table of contents. Now that we've applied our heading styles, we can put them to work. Let's use them to automatically generate a table of contents. Place your cursor where you want the table of contents to appear. Usually, at the beginning of the document, go to the References tab. Click on Table of Contents and choose one of the built-in designs. Word will instantly create a clickable table of contents for you. If you make changes to your document, don't forget to update the table of contents. Simply click inside it, then select update table. You can choose to update just the page numbers or the entire table. And that is it. If this video was helpful, hit the like button and subscribe for more Microsoft Office quick tips. See you in the next one.